Did you know that in 2019, a single engineering decision almost caused one of Britain's worst offshore disasters? Important disclaimer. This is a fictional scenario created for educational storytelling purposes about offshore wind engineering challenges. The Beatrice Wind Farm is real, but this specific incident is not based on actual events. Maintenance engineer Sarah Collins was trapped 400 feet above the North Sea as 90 mile per hour winds battered the Beatrice Wind Farm. She had discovered stress fractures in the turbine foundations that morning, but management refused to shut down during peak demand. Now the massive tower was swaying beyond all design limits. Foundation bolts began shearing one by one under the relentless cyclical loads. The maintenance platform shook violently as Collins desperately radioed for evacuation, but the rescue vessel couldn't approach in these conditions. Suddenly, a deafening crack echoed across the water. The 500-foot tower snapped at its base like a matchstick. Tons of steel and fiberglass crashed into the churning ocean below. Eight workers died instantly when the collapsing structure crushed their maintenance vessel. The investigation revealed fundamental flaws in offshore wind technology that the industry had ignored for years.